Hello, bit of a different video. Today we are in Toys R Us and we're going to go and have a look because it's 40% off. We're going to wander around, see what's there, see what we can find, see if any amiibo is on offer. So I guess some footage on the inside and we'll see you around. It's 20% off anyway, so whatever that is, so... Oh, yeah, that's so Lizzie and I are out of Toys R Us now. Um, Lizzie's still buying something inside. She's at the counter, but I thought I'd come to the car record this. There wasn't an awful lot of stuff there. Um, there wasn't really much stuff there. The shelves, shelves were empty, and even the stuff that was on offer wasn't really that good of a price. I was going to get some Amiibo, but it, they weren't even reduced to that much of a price. I think I can get them cheaper elsewhere. Um, I had a look at some Animal Crossing ones, really. And even with the 30% off, they were only reduced to about £8, which... The CEX, you can get them for cheaper than that. The one thing I did get, though, that was a really good price, was I got Paper Mario Sticker Star for the 3DS. That's stickered at £15, but with a 30% discount, was reduced to £10. £10.49. So, you're not going to get that cheaper, brand new, for less than 15 So, it's a really cool game to add to the 3DS collection. Really cool first party game as well that I wanted to add, so really pleased with that. Uh, we're heading home soon. Uh, I think we're heading to another toy, shop, toy store that's around here called Smith's, and hopefully do a bit of amiibo shopping whilst we're there. Um, but I must admit, it's been a sad morning. It was sad walking around there because it reminds you of being a kid and how much joy and how much delight that you got from walking around Toys R Us. And it's sad to see half the shelves empty and it just breaking down, but. I kind of understand why it has. I think it was just way overly priced. They didn't move with the times. They didn't progress. They didn't push enough to compete with other companies. And they kind of deserve what this really to go out of business because they've never really wanted to compete and it's shown. And uh, this is what happens when you don't compete. They go out of business. It's just really, really, really sad that the name's no longer there and that any kids that Lizzie and I have will never know Toys R Us and will never go around it and never have that same feeling but one of those things, time moves on and people need to move on so yeah, thank you very much and hopefully this might be the end of the video or we may have some extra footage that I'll attach to the end of this uh, of us walking around Smiths
Hello, just got out of Smith's and um, made one purchase in there. I got a Nintendo Switch Joy-Con grip, but it's the Super Mario Odyssey designed one. Uh, paid £15 for that. I literally now have zero money now until the end of the month, so it's living on dust until the end of the month, but oh well, it was worth it. Uh, really good store, lots of cool stuff. I wish I had a little more money though, that's the only problem. But no, happy to pick that up. Nice little collection to add to the Switch stuff.